a 4.1 magnitude earthquake striking in Idaho late Monday night. This is all part of the aftershocks that they are still feeling after that huge 6.5 quake that struck back on March 31st. I got a full breakdown coming for you guys. But first, do me a huge favor if you can. Give this video a like. I'll try to get the likes way up here on this video if you can. Share the video here across all your platforms. Help me beat the YouTube algorithms. Subscribe if you're brand new. And guys, just a little, gotta get this out there. For the, this is the question I get asked the most in the comment section. They wanna know, why do you wear these cheap, ridiculous sunglasses? Why well, wear them? Because I'm blind, okay? I'm a blind guy. I'm also a fat guy, so I'm a blind fat guy. So there you go. Hope that answers the question. Now you don't have to ask me in the comment section, okay? Also, if you enjoy my daily video content, would you consider sponsoring my ministry here for $5 a month or more? You could do so by visiting patreon.com slash conservative truth. Just check the pretty link. It's right down there in the description. It takes you're right there. You sign up and you got access to all my bonus content, the podcast where I talk more about sensitive information. I cannot talk about it here on YouTube because I'm a Christian conservative content creator. They would shut me down if I even tried to do it. It's exclusive for the Patreon members only. It also helps guys because YouTube is always, you know, demonetizing my videos. They're not even getting you guys the alerts for when I post these videos. It's terrible what they're doing here, guys. I'm just trying to bring you guys the news and events of what's taking place here in the last days. Speaking of which, that brings me back here to Idaho, late Monday night, about 20 miles northwest of Stanley, okay? A 4.1 magnitude quake shook that area. Again, it was right around where the big 6.5 hit back on March 31st. Many of the residents reported feeling this shaking. In fact, that was just one of eight quakes that were felt with a 2.5 or higher in a 24-hour period, okay? Before that 4.1, they were over 2.5 or greater, okay? So this has been going on now. And if you wanna look at the total amount of aftershocks since the big 6.5 hit, 479 quakes, aftershock quakes have hit the area since then. That is insane. And according to seismologists, they think that this may continue, especially since they had a quake that large to start with, with the 6.5. This could continue for quite some time to come. We'll keep an eye on it for you. Uh, no injuries to report here with this 4.1, nothing like that. So that's very good. Guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. I'll put more information on this quake in the description section if you would like to check that out. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you. And I'll talk with you soon.